Hey guys, welcome back to Barbie's Dream House. It's Jazz Hands, and today we're going to do Barbie's wedding gown. I've done my previous wedding gown that I made myself. It doesn't hold a candle to this one, as the booklet, which we'll look at first right here, will explain to us. Barbie wedding day set without doll number 972. Magnificent church wedding gown with formal train fashioned for a fairy princess. Tiny mock pearl tiara holds the tiered bridal veil. White satin gown under billowing layers of flowered nylon tulle. Short white nylon gloves, sentimental blue garter, bridal bouquet, and white slippers. The set, $5. Woo, that was a lot of money. <laughs> but look at the beautiful illustration they have. Now, I know that uh, it shows a blonde number one Barbie in here for the uh, set, but we're going to be doing a uh, the brunette because... This is a reproduction set, and this uh, particular set came out in 2009 um, in a Wedding Day Barbie and Ken reproduction set together, and uh, it had a brunette Barbie and a brunette Ken, and I don't feel like doing Ken in addition to this video. One, one, someday I'm going to do separate ones probably for each of them, but I want to get all of the wedding outfits and put them all together in one video for fun. So here's a little blue garter. We're going to put that on her leg first for her sentimental blue garter. There we are. Looks nice, something blue. Take out her earrings that she currently has because that was something you would have had to do yourself and put in your other ones. And I had to get out the scary brass pearl earrings because the safe ones I was using were not going in. So now I'm using these again, despite not wanting to. <laughs> Fits, there we are. Hopefully it stays in. Wish they could find a better way to make these so that they didn't turn the doll's ears green, but whatever. These are reproductions, so it's okay. Pearl earring in, and now the beautiful dress, which has this very, uh, very delicate uh, netting on top that was a, you know, it was a, oh, there goes her earring. Well, whatever. I'll do it later. I'll do it afterwards. You have to be careful when putting it on because the little uh, hands can catch and get caught on it but I guess with the gloves on first there you go it slides right on without catching anything surprisingly I didn't think it'd be that easy I guess it was a good thing that I did the I did the gloves I always do the gloves in advance on my videos because they're little horrible wretches to put on and it really just made that a lot easier <laughs> crazy easy actually and I think that's supposed to go underneath yep There goes the other earring. Fine. We'll do you last then. I don't have to move you all around. That goes up and over. Yeah, I, I mean, that's a very 50s style is the sheer shoulders over the outfit, which I love. Put that down. Snap and snap. Oh man, that's gorgeous. Look at how pretty you look, Barbie. Oh, and her shoes. Don't want to forget her shoes. The way over here on the corner. Okay, with white shoes, and because this is a number one reproduction, we've got holes in the bottom of the feet for her. And her stand is right there, right in front of my face. So busy looking off to the side, don't even see it. She's looking beautiful. Look at that. That is a gorgeous outfit. Uh, beautiful, like, silver on it. Tiered dress. Big train. So pretty. Uh, where'd the earrings go? Uh, earrings, where'd you go? Well, I found one. Well, I guess you're not going to get to see it with earrings. Well, there's one earring. I'll put it in. Go in. And the other one, anywhere? Huh. Okay, fine. <laughs> I guess you don't get the other earring in. Well, whatever. Oh, my camera's, my microphone's not plugged in. Oh, man, this video. Oh, I found the other earring. Oh, thank goodness, it's saved. We'll deal with crappy audio afterwards after the fact. I don't care, just as long as I get it done. And there's the other earring, so we'll put that in so she looks correct. 
and my gloves are messing with me. It's a really pretty set. Uh, $5 definitely was expensive. Um, I was talking about it with work, and he said, uh, yeah, $5 for something? That's a whole tank of gas back in 1960. So, I mean, <laughs> that's not something people would spend willingly very quickly. Bouquet. I'm just going to kind of put that right there, although it has a little string for her to hold it. I can't. <sighs> Fine. Gloves are off, because every video I have to do it. I'm gonna get. It, I'm gonna get eventually hit the point where I'm gonna get disappointed if I don't take off my gloves. I bet. Everybody has to look at my chewed up hands from my cat. She just loves to play. There we go. I did it. I can't believe it. All right, finally, we've got her bridal veil. Let's see, how does it go on? I think like this. Yeah, there we go. So you could wear it like that, and uh, it's got that full train effect. I mean, that's very pretty or you could also put it up and over for when she's you know about to kiss Ken and uh can't have the ponytail over it then but uh yeah I like to bear the other way putting it back Go. There we go. Gloves are going back on now. So that's a, it's a beautiful set. It was a reproduction, the one that I got, and uh, I do love it. I just, uh, I don't display it very often because I don't really have like any romantic views of uh, getting married or anything. But of course, little girls did, and that was one of the things back in the 50s and 60s that you were basically taught. You were going to get married to a nice man, run your house, and have your kids. So yeah, that, that's like the final 1959 outfit I think that I currently own because I don't own any of the sleeping ones. But uh, there she is, Wedding Day Barbie. Uh, try to pick her up if you can. They made, they made a replica like in 1997 that doesn't look quite the same as this one. It's not quite as like a full skirt when they did their version. But it still looks nice as its own like separate outfit. And this uh, 2009 one definitely looks beautiful. The uh, uh, vintage ones, if you find a vintage one, they've aged to like a beautiful like uh, yellow ivory, which looks very pretty. But the pure um, originals will be like Snow White, like this one or the reproductions. So there's Barbie's wedding day, imagining herself off to get married to Ken. This is Jazz Hands, and I hope to see you for my next video. Bye.